Felix Ballet House State Historic Site. The structure was built in the year 1818 by a man named Jacob Phillipson. The Ballet family purchased it in the year 1824. Today we're celebrating what we call the Reveillon or the Awakening. And that was basically the Christmas festival of the day. So it would be pretty common to go to a midnight mass on Christmas Eve, and then you'd go back to the patriarch of the family's home, where you'd spend the next several hours kind of having a feast and you know, a festival, enjoying yourselves. We've kind of got it laid out in the same way. Uh, everything you see today is very symbolic. This, for example, I'll give you the meanings of things. So we have apples, which represent man's downfall. We have wafer, wafers that represent redemption. It is in a circle because it's never ending. The greenery is everlasting life. Candles, which we're actually going to light here in a little bit, are for the light of the world. And you'll see that things are in three for Trinity. And kind of as you go through the house, we have things set up very similar to what they would have had, down to a very customary feast, which we have represented in the dining room. The French went to midnight mass and they came home to this feast that they called Le Young, which means the awakening. And they came home to whatever uh, that they could afford, I would imagine. And we have turkey and they had uh, uh, bread and cheese and sausages. We have a tortillere the, on the, the pie that looks like the pie on the corner there. It was made with ground beef and uh, the ground potatoes and onions. And then the, the main feature of the Revion was to have 13 desserts one for each of the 12 disciples and one for Christ. So we have 13 desserts here and then on the table over there. The feature was to have the, the 13th dessert was the Bouche de Noël, which is made to look like the Yule log for that the French had. The French did not have the Christmas tree. They decorated the log and burned it in the fireplace. And uh, the uh, Bouche de Noël was to represent the Yule log. So we're giving some samples of the new log, and we have some cookies too. So. Yeah, the cookies are delicious. Oh, thank you. Because <laughs> <laughs> of your hay. Okay, so we're going to take it back to the beginning. 